Idea Dream Home Season 5. Who doesn't have a dream home? We are presenting here 50 such dream homes which are being evaluated by our experts and by the end of the season, we'll, we'll get to know who is the top amongst the list. Let's meet our judges. Arun Vidya Sagar and Anna Kuruvilla. Let's move on to the visual of uh, the contesting home for today. Uh, it's from Pachalam. The house is called Najila. It's a fairly huge property. It's 11,000 square feet house. Let's see how creatively they have used the space. Hello people and welcome to Idea Dream Home Season 5. I'm standing in front of the beautiful Najila house in Pachalam, Ernalan district. Uh, this house is 11,000 square feet area built in the contemporary style. The landscape area complements the huge house. The house is 11,000 square foot area and the landscape area has been kept good and big enough. They have the square shaped lawn space, then garden area goes uh, to the perimeters of this area. Then uh, they also have a natural stone fountain right next to the entrance gate. The house is white in color, it's completely fine and they have done st uh, natural stone cladding on the walls. They have two main entrances with an each extension to the car parking space that makes this dual car parking area and dual entrance. Then the flooring uses an entire area. The sit out area is actually granite. They also have done stone cladding on the walls. It's white walls and stone cladding. It gives a very um, you know pretty look. Then I will also, also highlight about the uh, vegetation that they have used. The natural vegetation in the car parking space. I see a lot of plants so it gives a refreshing outlook to the exteriors. Before going in, I would like to explain the door uh, because it's not an ordinary, it's, uh, it has got some special features like the wood, the material that we used is Pinkoda wood uh, with steel frame on both the sides as you're seeing it. The LED lights have been attached. So all these, the box, the round round things that you're seeing is, is actually LED uh, lights. So the both entrances, the same uh, door has been used. Then the Pinkoda wood design has been used for the window frames as well. I told you about the dual entrances. So this entrance leads us to the uh, drawing room. Uh, but to talk about the details in the drawing space, first of all, the beautiful work that they have done, it's wallpaper. The golden wallpaper complements the golden color scheme of the sofas. So it all together gives a very qu quite a, a grand appeal. In the ceiling, they have used fall ceiling with indirect lighting has been provided. Well, they have windows on both the sides and right next to the door too. So that helps in the cross ventilation and lighting. Uh, the full flooring space, they have done granite completely in the house. Um, the windows are covered by the orange golden shade um, curtains which complements the color scheme of the room. The highlights of this master bedroom, they have uh, used um, instead of the wall in the headboard area, they have actually uh, a wood paneling complete in the backdrop with the family portrait and plywood has been used uh, for the bed and as well as the paneling done. The ceiling otherwise they have a fall ceiling with LED lights have been provided. The wardrobes are glass, tinted glass have been used for the wardrobe doors. It's built in wardrobes. They have a courtyard in the master bedroom uh, so that gives a pleasant feel to the decor. They have used uh, tile cladding and designer um, glasses to uh, customize it. Uh, well, the flooring is vitrified tiles in this particular area, otherwise it's completely granite. 
Above it's a pergola design that's covered by the polycarbonate sheet which lets in a lot of natural light. They also have a separate dress area uh, for this room that's attached to the bathroom. So an island kitchen that is designed in the red and black theme. Granite slab have been used completely and the cabinets are in red and black color. We have windows in both the sides which helps in the cross ventilation. The windows are covered by the roll up lines in the color scheme of this entire uh, kitchen. In the ceiling space they have been fall ceiling with LED lights and the center space um, wood paneling has been done in the color that goes in with the color of the cabinets. All the electronic amenities of the kitchen like the fridge, um, grill, microwave are built in and the kitchen is attached to a separate work area and storage space. The design of the dining table is quite unique. Um, it's actually a hanging dining table. The four rods that you're seeing, it's steel rods. They are painted uh, with black and LED strips have been provided inside it. So it's actually a big hang, uh, dining table, 10 seater. Right next to the dining table, uh, they have the crockery shelf. Then uh, the wash area also is located quite close to it. And they also have a common toilet right next to the wash area. room has a separate entrance too. They have kept the decor of the living area to the minimum with just the sofa space covering the majority of the area. In the ceiling it's a fall ceiling with LED lights. Now um, there's a lot of transparency between um, the different parts like standing here where I can have a good look at the dining area, also the center courtyard space and the other bedrooms as well. It's a three floor house and the spiral design staircase takes us to the upper floors. Uh, the area beneath the staircase has been well utilized by making it converting into a center courtyard area. They also have a natural vegetation which um, gives a very refreshing look to the, you know, the staircase area which otherwise looks quite dull. And uh, what they have done is the staircase wall, it's actually textured work. Um, it's a particular theme like the, the main elements the sun, moon, um, water, earth. So they mixed all and created a quite colorful and trendy pattern. First thing up the staircase is the family living area that's covered by the sofas. Now they have three bedrooms in this particular floor. The ceiling is done in the same pattern, fall ceiling with uh, LED lights. To adding beauty in the ceiling is the hanging chandelier. Designed in the contemporary manner, which actually is the theme of the whole house. Uh, red seems to be the main color of this bedroom. They have red wood paneling done, um, then LED lights on the ceiling. The walls have not been kept uh, plain and mundane. They have used complete wallpaper design, which gives a very um, nice look to the whole bedroom. Granite flooring. They also have a separate dress area. Uh, red wardrobes, red built-in wardrobes actually. The dress area splits out to a bathroom. The 
guests surely get a luxurious treatment in this house. I'm standing in the guest bedroom and you know, looking around me, you can see a lot of purple colors. Well, the purple curtains, then in the bed sheet, even the purple. So everything, the color scheme goes in sync quite well. Ceiling, they have done a fall ceiling with LED lights. Indirect lighting has also been provided inside the gypsum board. They have a separate dress area. Yes, the headboard wall is different. It's plywood design with niche has been provided to keep the show pieces. Even the bed design is quite unique. If you see, it's actually suspended. The whole weight is suspended on one side. Each bedroom has been designed differently. In this bedroom, they have used light blue uh, color shade to do the deco. The bed is round shape and the headboard area is covered with mirrors. In the ceiling space, it's fall ceiling with a different uh, blue light strips has been added to it. The big balcony space on the first floor. We've taken care of the floor and fauna by building flower bed on the balcony wall. Well, the flooring used in this entire space is granite. They also have done stone cladding. Um, the all complete wall, they have done stone cladding. This bedroom has been done in the Barbie doll theme. The pink wallpaper is on the walls, which looks absolutely stunning. Then the ceiling, they have done LED light with fall ceiling. Now one more peculiar thing is they have audio systems installed in all the bedrooms, which is controlled by the master bedroom. The main colors used in the bedroom are purple and pink, which is reflected on the study table as well as the uh, wooden cabinet and the niche. There's mirror face sliding door leads us to the dressing area.